Hi my beautiful family and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to review this chic leather pink squat palette. I already have a review with the other bronze palette but this is a pink squad and I can't wait to try this on my face. I already have all of my makeup done except of course the bronze, the blush, contour, highlight, everything else. So if you're interested to see how this is going to work on my me and what I think about this palette then please keep on watching. This one has the Hula bronzer, it has the Tickle, a new highlighter in this palette, it has California blush, it has a Dallas blush, I think, and Denline. It has like two, three blushes, bronzer and a new highlighter, so we'll see. Open the packaging. It's a very nice, beautiful color. This one is looks to be suitable for deeper skin toes. But let's watch all of the shades. Let's watch the Hula bronzer. Let's tweakle the new highlighter. Then we have California, the blush. And we have Daniel Line. I can't pronounce this blush too. And another blush, Dallas, that looks more like a, for me, for my skin tone, it'd be suitable like a bronzer, we'll see. We have the Hula, we have the new, oh, this is a stunning shade, highlighter, California, oh, they smell so good. This blush, and this one looks like to be more uh, as a contour for my skin tone, but if you have a deeper skin tone, it smells so good. This will be perfect as a, as a blush. So let's go and I will definitely try uh, this Dallas as a contour and uh, use this brush. Use it to take out my to kind of use it on my cheeks. This looks so beautiful for this. So if you have a lighter skin tone as me, this could be definitely be used for this. This could be used for <laughs> this shade, could be used for this. Then let's go to the Hula bronzer. We'll take my bronzer palette. I already know I really like this bronzer because it is also in that other palette. This is a very, very nice bronze. And now I, now I know why people really love it so much. It blends beautifully. It's so nice, pigmented, also very easy to build up. And they have Hula Light and also Hula Caramel. I don't know what the name is of that deeper Hula bronzer, but it's a very, very nice. I like this. down here okay let's go into the blush and with my blush palette here it is I'm going to go in with this uh, blush first this blush here it's a nice pinky color it doesn't have any shimmer or uh, uh, maybe a very soft shimmer to it Oh, this palette smells like candy. I love it. And it goes very nice with my eye makeup look. This makeup look is going to be on my channel soon. I don't know if this is going to be for, but this is the um, Jeffree Star palette that I'm going to review. Or I already reviewed on my channel. I don't know. I really like this blush. It also blends good beautifully. I'm going to take a little bit of this California also and kind of... This one has more sheen and I really like it because it doesn't exaggerate my pores on my uneven skin tone. 
really like this palette. There is also a trio, a smaller version of this palette. I'm going to put links down below where you can check out this, this palette, the bronze palette, and also the smaller version of these palettes. But also link card up here so you can watch my review of bronze palette, which I use every day since that because I really, really like it. Okay, and then we go in in this last shade, this highlighter. I hope this would be okay for my skin tone. I'm scared it's going to be a little bit too dark, but we'll see. It has a beautiful sheen. Purple gold color goes perfect with this California high, California color. I think it looks good. I know, please let me know down below if you think this is too dark for my skin tone. I think I can pull this off. It has a nice sheen to it. It doesn't look too dark, but I don't know. In real life, I don't see if that it's a little bit too dark, but please let me know down below how it transforms on the camera or on this video. I like this. I like this a lot. I'm going to put some lip gloss on top. This is Essence lip gloss. So guys, this is the final look. I love every shade in this palette. It also goes very nice with my skin tone. I can make every shade work. I think it's going to be also good for deeper skin tones. You can use this as a um, bronzer. But also you can use it as a blush. This one, I really love every shade. I also really like this highlighter uh, and it smells wonderful. I have always wanted to try more Ben of Benefit products. I'm very glad that I have this also and the Under Bronze Squad palette. I don't know which one I prefer more. I can't really say. Let me show these two, the difference between them. I first thought that this would be more suitable for deeper skin tones, but it, it's not. Let me take out this brush. Okay, let's show you. So I don't know, I think it depends what color of blushes you want or highlighter. I love this highlighter up here and I think this one twinkle also looks very, very good. It depends what you like, what you prefer, but I'm definitely keeping both of them because I love the blushes and Hula Bronze I it's I always love bronzers too, so I really like everything that I have on my face right now. I think it turned out good. Everything blends very nice. I recommend these palettes. If you can't afford these palettes, they are a little bit up in the price. You can definitely check out the trio, the smaller version. Of course, there is links down below. But over, overall, I really think this uh, face makeup turned out beautifully. So guys, please give a thumbs up if you like this video. Comment down below if you tried any of these palettes uh, and what do you think about them. Thank you so much for watching and I hope I see you in my next video. I love you all. Bye!